blood work's another big one. And I stress this really, really highly because blood work is key for anything that you guys really want to look at internally and make sure that you're up to date. Thank you for the badge. I appreciate it. Guys, don't forget to get your badges. And if you guys are on Facebook, you guys can now get stars. I'd really appreciate it if you guys did, if you guys wanted to. Uh, obviously, there's no pressure. It just helps the algorithms. And Facebook and Instagram, let them know, like, listen, I'm giving out great information. What up, Renee Barbie? Maria's in the house. If you guys haven't seen her, she is definitely a firecracker. 100%. So let's get into the therapy of the week with the Titan Trifectus. Titan Trifecta is Hercules Potion, ECA Stack Plus, and Titan Complete. These are three awesome therapies. So let me get into each one of them for you guys. Let's talk about Titan Complete because we had our Jay on here and he said now Titan Complete just hits on another level. So Titan Complete alone, this is one of the awesome vitamin amino acid injectable combinations um, that will affect you in a number of different ways with a number of hopefully different benefits health-wise they are going to help you guys out. Let's talk about what they are. So we have Titan Complete, which has MYC, methionine, inositol, and choline. You might have seen that around a lot of weight loss or B12 injectables. We have the MYC, the fat burner MYC. So all three of those are in Titan Complete to start. Then you talk about B vitamins. And B vitamins are very important for everyday life. So when we talk about B vitamins, we talk about metabolism, we talk about nervous system, we talk about uh, you know, your hair, skin, nails, you know, that's affected in B vitamins too as well, along with energy and a number of other different health benefits. So you're getting B1 through B6 in Titan Complete, which is another big one, right? And then we talk about branched chain amino acids. And we talk about branched chain amino acids. There are only three branched chain amino acids. They are also essential amino acids. And essential amino acids means that your body doesn't produce them, you have to get it from an outside source, whether it be food or supplementation of some sort. So these brain chain amino acids, valine, isoleucine, and leucine, these things are awesome for building lean quality mu muscle, uh, for weight loss, for not going to catabolic uh, you know, mode in your body, right? Your body not getting and breaking down what you built up so hard to work and, and, and get, right? So these are really, really awesome to have in there. And then you have L-carnitine. So L-carnitine by itself is great for blood flow, it's great for building muscle, it's great for cardiovascular. There's a lot of different things that L-carnitine alone is great for. And this is all an injectable with little insulin units. So it's this big. A lot of people are like scared, I'm scared of injections. But they think of these big, you know, harpoon needles and they're not thinking of the little insulin needles that people use every day, right? And these are very simple. You just inject it, you're on your way and, and you're going about your day and you're getting all the benefits right away. So it's... It's really just a great injectable all the way. So that's just Titan Complete alone. Then we go into ECA Stack Plus. So your Titan Complete, you usually want to take in the morning, get your metabolism moving, you got some natural energy, your, your metabolism's you know, functionally optimal, right? Um, another thing is you're helping you know, fats getting processed through the liver faster with this combination of, uh, of, of vitamins and amino acids there too as well. And then you have ECA Stack Plus, which is ephedrine, real ephedrine HCL, caffeine, B12, and chromium. It also has aspirin in it too as well. So ephedrine, caffeine, aspirin, B12, and chromium. So ephedrine, real ephedrine HCL, you can't get over the counter. Um, now I know you know there's some, some medications out there like sickness medications, congestion medications, um, where I think you might be able to get some ephedrine in or used to, but like bronchate, I'll say it straight up. But you know when you start messing with bronchate, you know because people use the by, by bronchate, then they're getting bronchate and they're trying to like you know divvy it up with caffeine and add some aspirin in, I guess, and you know that might work like a Frankenstein capsule if you really make something like that. I wouldn't really recommend it. I wouldn't take it myself because you have to get those congestion medications in there. You probably don't need those. I mean, for somebody that really wants to get a quick fix, I guess that would be okay route, but I really wouldn't recommend it, and I wouldn't say it's it's optimal way to take it. But if you get it through us, it's got real ephedrine HCL, caffeine, aspirin, B12, and chromium. So ephedrine and caffeine are going to be, they're stimulants, and they're going to be great for as far as helping you burn fat in the body, helping you energize, and more mental clarity too as well. You'll be functioning tip-top, right? It's great. Um... You know, those two alone are going to be great for weight loss and for energy. And then you add in a little bit of aspirin. So the aspirin is going to help for you no know, heart palpitations, thin the blood just a little bit, but not too much, right? And then we talk about B12 
B12 and chromium. So B12 is going to be great for energy. And then chromium is also going to help support and boost the metabolism as well. So it's going to help along with weight loss. So it's an added function onto the ephedrine and caffeine without any no more stimulants. You know, this is something that's going to be you know, good for your body as far as the B12 and the chromium. Um, you know, this is going to be a great one. So you have Titan Complete, you have ECA Stack Plus. Now you're going to add in Hercules Potion. So your Hercules Potion is going to have glutamine, arginine, ornithine, lysine, L-citrulline, proline, taurine, NEC, and L-carnitine. It's a lot just on its own. And this one by itself too is a game changer um, as far as recovery with glutamine. Arginine and L-citrulline, precursors to nitric oxide, and then vasodilation. So you're talking about opening up the blood vessels, taking a lot more blood through the body, helping with the pump too as well. And with that pump, you're talking about long-lasting pumps. So usually when somebody takes like a pre-workout per se, or you know something that's going to give them a pump, um, they usually take it orally, they're, they're taking it right before they go to the gym, and they go in the gym, they, they might feel nauseous in their stomach because of some of the ingredients, um, you know, all over the place like a pinball um, because you know the the stimulant factor in it and then the pump right they're looking for these different things and most of them do have arginine l-citrulline but you get this pump and then that pump lasts probably about 15 minutes after, after you leave the gym right you're all pumped up you look great you, know, you bounce off the walls hopefully you don't have to go to the bathroom <laughs> and uh you know you're leaving so after that it kind of deflating down whereas hercules potion is really gonna help you keep a pump for, I mean, I'd say for me it's about four to six hours. You're gonna get a lot more longer lasting pump leaving the gym, you know, even for like, you know, I tell people like guys, like for like your pool days, uh, beach days and stuff like that, you wanna get those beach muscles and usually for guys it's, you know, bite, you know, it's arms and chest and stuff like that, and abs if you got them, and shoulders. So, you know, if you really want to get that pump before you go in, I tell them, I said, listen, you, you can do the injection, right? You can do it 30 to 45 minutes before you go there. Um, and then at that point when you get there, bust down, do about 50 push-ups, and you should be good to go. Oh, <clears throat> excuse me. You should be good to go. You'll be good to go and long-lasting as far as that goes out there. But those two ingredients right alone will increase that instant gratification for pump for you guys. And that's the first thing you guys will notice from it. The other thing you'll notice from it is the ornithine. So ornithine is an anti-fatiguing amino acid. So that means you're going to be able to do more strenuous activity, and it should help you get better result if you're doing more strenuous activity, right? If you're working harder or being able to work harder in the gym or in your exercise or your activities, whatever it is, this should definitely get you farther and better where you're at, right? So ornithine does that. So you'll be like, man, like I, get, I the, the most common response is, I felt like I could just keep going, right? What up, B-Muzin? El Baraccio, what's going on? Pinu, Miss PYP, Gene.Pitbull, what's going on? Ambroso, what's going on? Brian, TFW, how you going? Straight addicts in the house. Yes, ECA stack is tried and true. Lexi Wendell, what's going on here? What's going on? Jay Almonds, what's going on? I hope all is well. Whole squad, I've noticed with but consistent use of Hercules Potion, the pumps come faster and last longer sometimes days. Hulk squad. You know, for me, I've been taking it for like eight years now, and uh, it definitely does. I mean, it works every single time for me. So there's not like, you know, some people are like, oh, can I take this forever? Or, you know, if I take, you know, today and tomorrow and next week, is it still going to help me out, you know, the week afterwards? Yes, it is. So when we talk about, you know, we talked about glutamine for recovery. We talked about arginine, L-citrulline for the, the pump factor, the vasodilation, the blood flow. Ornithine for the anti-fatiguing factor, doing more strenuous activity, being able to work out longer and more activity. And then we start getting into the other ones. So NAC is great for, you know, liver support and liver functions, right? That's an antioxidant per se and helping you with your body. Then we talk about... Um, lysine. So lysine is an immune system booster on its own, right? It's great, you know, a lot of people out there, you know, 50% of our population or somewhere around that area has HSV-1 or HSV-2. And if you guys know what that is, you know. And at that point, this is another thing that helps out with that as well. So it's going to help boost the immune system all the way around. And then we talk about Proline. So proline is a, like a collagen-based amino acid, so it's going to help lubricate some of those joint areas and, and hopefully, you know, make you feel a little bit better in there, not as dry. Uh, you know, a lot of people have maybe tendonitis, and they, they have a lot of number, number of different things that might be affecting their joint areas. Well, this could help those areas. So I don't want to break down every single one because there's quite a few. Talk about L-carnitine again. So L-carnitine is another one that's in there. 
and that's great for like blood flow. It's good for muscle building, a number of different great health benefits. And then taurine. So taurine is great for brain function. It's great for uh, you know, you know, anti cramping as well. So there's a lot of things that taurine is great for too. So that's the ultimate one right there. So Hercules potion by itself is just a monster. ECA Stack Plus, it's great alone by itself. Titan Complete's another monster. So you'll get all three of the of, of these therapies together with the Titan Trifecta. And there's a discount if you get all three together. That's why the Titan Trifecta package exists. And I want everybody to be able to experience all three of the therapies and save some money on it instead of having to pick or choose like, should I take this one or should I take this one because my budget, you know, it's there. And that's a real world thing that, you know, I, I take in consideration for the patients. I'm like, listen, you know, is this going to be a lot of bang for the buck? And it really is. So if you guys have not used these therapies, definitely recommend, you know, maybe even try one to start. And then, you know, after you see how good the first one works, hopefully, you'll want to get the other ones. And you can get the Titan Trifecta package and save some dough on it for sure, 100%. Uh, I have a lot of tight medical therapies that I love, but 100% of the time, if someone asks me which one I take, I always say Hercules Potion first because you notice it right away from the start. Fox Squad, you're absolutely right, dude. And that's that's the best thing about Hercules Potion. It's instant gratification. And, you know, you can use this in different muscle groups too as well um, to help those muscle groups, those lagging body parts or things that haven't been responded or maybe you got an accident, you have atrophy in these different areas, nerve damage, all these different things. You can utilize Hercules Potion for those things too as well and help get some benefits out of it but it's definitely one of my go-to's it's definitely a number of our patients go-to's you know there's people that might be doing HRT somewhere else or this and that or whatever it is um, or not nothing at all and all they come to us for is for this potion which is fine you don't have to be on HRT with us to take you know you can take advantage of everything that we offer here and not have to do one single thing, if that makes any sense. So you don't have to be on HRT to take advantage of blood testing through us or the Hercules Potion or Titan Effect or ECAs, whatever it is. So I just want you guys to know that. Now the Titan Effect is even awesomer because there's no blood work needed. Um, there's no hormones or anything in this. So at that point, all you have to do to get the Titan Effect is fill out the new patient paperwork, which is so easy and simple. It's online for you guys to do. And then at that point, we will get that new patient paperwork when you submit it. We'll call you and then schedule a medical consultation with our medical provider and then go over all your health history, family health, health history, your goals, your symptoms, issues going on, and then talk about some of the therapies that would best suit you and benefit you. And if you have questions about a certain therapy, you can always ask about that and we're here for you all the time. Even if you start therapies and you only start, let's say, Hercules Potion, and you see some new therapy of the week, you're like, wow, that's really cool. You can call up or text and ask about that too as well. And we'll get right back to you and respond and talk to you about it. And if you want to go ahead with that, you're more than welcome to too as well. So that's what it is. Titan Medical Center is the best of the best. I appreciate that. Raw. Art said, I'm not a big guy, but I've noticed my triceps especially pop when I inject her good potion once a day for a week. Like it literally stays pumped up and I can live longer, harder, no bull. It's true, Art. I mean, I mean, I do it and everybody's going to be like, oh yeah, like you're the only you're going to say I'm telling you guys, I would not tell you something's going to work if it didn't work. Uh, my reputation is everything to me. At that point, I don't care. Like, I'm not. I, there's therapies out there that the pharmacies, you know, they have. And if you know, I'm the, like your rat and your test dummy. I'll go through it first and be like, this is going to be good. This is kind of what I got out of it. And if it's not good, I'm like, I'm not going to tell the providers even look at this. Like, it's not even going to be an option. Like, if it's not good. It's not good. Whether it's not good health-wise, like, you know, it might get you a short-term effect, but can be damaging in the long-term. We're not doing that for patients. Um, you know, or if it's something that just doesn't get the pop, I'm not going to tell you, hey, listen, this is what it does, and it doesn't do that. Because I'm not going to have you come back to me like, John, you told me this. I'm not doing that. Even when it comes to referrals. Somebody asked me for a referral and for somebody, unless I really know that person, I can literally vouch, like, this person's not going to make me look stupid. I'm not going to give a referral unless I know for sure 100%. And I hate that. Some people give me referrals sometimes, totally off topic. And like I got a referral for, my, for a lighting guy for my, for my house, right, from the builder. And at that point, the guy came out, like, it's been really sketchy, I'll just be honest with you guys. And over and over, and I kind of told the builder, hey, I was like, you know, this guy's been, mm. he's like, oh, he's like, well, that was uh, somebody's cousin. And I really didn't, I'm like, dude, why would you refer to this guy? Are you kidding me? Come on. It's, it's nuts, guys. Facebook comment from Revere Nesto. Does TRT trigger anxiety? Great question, and no. So TRT should be like this. It, now listen, if your hormones are not balanced, right? 
then you could be getting negative symptoms of some sort. Now, when you have high estrogen levels, you could be getting some anxiety. There are some different things that may cause anxiety, but TRT is not going to do it if you do it correctly, and that is hormone replacement therapy. We talk about TRT, and that's the natural verbiage for people out there. And I see a lot of people talking like, hey, I'm on TRT, or hey, what do you do for TRT? So TRT is testosterone replacement therapy. When we talk about that, the reason I really don't like to use that term too much is because when I say that, then people are like, oh, testosterone replacement therapy. So that's all they're focused on is testosterone. But when we look at things, and we really have to look at the big picture of things and all the other details in that picture, and we talk about hormone replacement therapy because you're ultimately replacing hormones that are deficient or not there, and then you're going to have to balance. So hormone balancing, you could call it too as well, because if you introduce testosterone, let's say it's 200 milligrams a week, right? You know, some people, they might not convert as much into estrogen. Some people are estrogen sensitive and convert a ton into estrogen. And at that point, what happens is, is when their estrogen goes high, that's when, you know, you're irritable, you can be sensitive and cry for fris or frisky commercials, um, you know, you can be getting fat deposits on the body, possible gynecomastia, anxiety, and all these other different, different things. So, you know, when we talk about that, we really need to talk about all the other different things. And then we talk about balancing gonadal support for, you know, for guys that's our, our testes, right? And we want to make sure they don't shrink or, you know, tightness or you're losing semen volume or anything like that, right? Because you want everything to work optimal. You shouldn't have to shut anything down in the body. Things shouldn't have to not be working properly. Or you shouldn't feel any anxiety or feeling worse. You know, when we balance hormones correctly or you have them balanced correctly, everything is working like it should. So you, it should literally take you back in aging by 10 to 20 years. And 10 to 20 years ago, you know, you had these levels, but you didn't have anxiety back then, right? If you did have anxiety back then, then this could be something else and it's not hormone replacement therapy or TRT. It could be something else that could be affecting you in your life or something that's going on, okay? Just, just to throw that out there. Big Drew in the house, my dude. Uh, yes, Hulk Squad said, yes, I use Hercules to catch my left arm up to my right two weeks and I noticed the difference. That is awesome, Hulk Squad. You know, I, I definitely noticed it while me, I, I, I had other people, I've tested this theory out with some other people and man, it's worked every time. I've had some people that have been in motorcycle accidents, break femurs and the whole nine. And when you do that, that's a serious, serious incident, an accident, and it can cause permanent damage. And not only that, you're in this cast for I don't know how long. And you're not working your leg out. And your other leg is getting worked out to some degree, right? It's walking, it's doing this, where the other leg is just straight, you're crutching it up, or you're in a wheelchair. So when that cast comes off, then you have this atrophy. And you just can't get back to working out. You're like, oh, I'll just catch this thing up. No, man, you got to go through physical therapy and, and all these different things to try to get those muscles out of atrophy and that leg get, go going. So, you know, with that comes shrinkness, and, and it sucks. And then you're like, man, I got to start building this thing back up. And that's really where the rehab comes into play and then the, you know, the weightlifting and all the other different stuff that comes along. But using this, you really do. You get a more mind and muscle connection too as well. And a lot of people don't know what that, some people don't know what that feels like. I won't say a lot. Some people out there don't, they have no idea what a mind and muscle connection and contraction is. And that's when you literally, it's so cool once you, be, you can be able to do it, you can literally focus and connect with that muscle and you're literally contracting and feeling everything that you're pumping in. It's cool, man. When you have control, the older I get, you know, 41, and there's people who are probably older than me out there, maybe you're younger. But the older you get, or, you know, I guess maybe you can be younger and see the same thing, but the more I learn about my body, the more I can control my body or I know exactly how it's going to function and what's going to happen. Really, really cool. You learn more about yourself, I guess, as, as time goes on, right? Um, so this is something that I've learned. It definitely helped me out for sure. Hercules works wonders on laggy body parts, Big Drew. Can you send to the UK? I'm sorry. So we can only service the United States right now, but I am looking at this UK thing, like really serious. Um, and I've got somebody that told me that they can do these different things around the world. So, or at least get me into these countries to be able to help people out. If I can do that, it's going to be coming. I'm telling you guys, I'm very excited about something like that. Uh, I think that a lot of people in the world would like to take advantage of these therapies. I get it all the time. So you're not alone in the UK. Love your products. How is it possible so many supplement shops and websites carry MK677 for a very cheap price? Is the same MK677 from Titan? 
Great question, Jordan. I love that you brought this up. Okay, so you say, John, I, I see you got MK677, right? And your MK677 is $275 for a month's supply. Like, okay, cool. Now I typed up in MK677 online, and then I see this place called something research chemical and they sell mk677 i even see these ads pop up on facebook and there's just like 50 bucks 20 bucks whatever it is right it's really cheap and inexpensive so why is yours more expensive great question so here's the answer all right and tell me if this is not a good answer jordan please so the reason is is this when you get things from like a research chemical side or whatever it is Literally on the, on the bottle you get or whatever, it says not for human consumption right away, right? Ours comes from a U.S. licensed pharmacy prescribed in your name. That's one thing. So at least you got a little bit of peace of mind like, hey, you know, it's coming prescribed, you know, at least it's coming from a pharmacy. Where's the other guys getting it from? They're not producing it in like an FDA factory, okay? A lot of these people are getting it from China and stuff like that. And they're selling it. It's like a gray area right now, right? Uh, it's, they're not supposed to be selling it for human consumption. It's supposed to be for research purposes only, and they're selling it for human consumption. And they're making that insinuation that you can take it. So there's going to be some sort of crackdown coming down. Right? They already have cracked down a lot of these places, but MK677, that's one difference. The other difference is this. Ours is tested, and it comes from a U.S. licensed pharmacy. So you know what you're getting for sure 100%. So if you're getting something that's 275 bucks, you get something for 50 bucks. If the one that's 50 bucks really doesn't have what it says it is, or you have no idea what's really in it, then is it really a good deal? Probably not. So that's the big difference is between us and somebody out there that's selling MK677 in a supplement shop or whatever it is. They're not supposed to be selling in a supplement shop, so if they are, they're working in a gray area. You'll never see a GNC, a vitamin shop, Walgreens, or somebody that's a big box retailer doing that. Um, so those guys are they're on the fringe and they're working those gray areas as much as they possibly can. Right? So that's the difference, Jordan. So you know exactly what you're getting. We back it 100%. You know, it's tested. And we, we're not putting this into bios here. It's coming from pharmacy. We, have no, we, we don't touch you guys' medication. So, you know, some people are like, hey, I need to hurt this potion. You guys just grab it for me and ship it out. Like, it's not on our shelf. Like, we're not on these on shelves. Like, nothing's over the counter here. Everything's prescribed. Prescriptions go to the pharmacy. And the pharmacy ships to you guys directly. We have no... No, no deal with that whatsoever. Uh, by the way, there is nothing on the market, black market, legit market, that comes close or even compares to this potion. This is so true, 100%, dude. High Evo Fitness, what's going on? I hope everything is well. Uh, those shops don't send from a U.S. licensed pharmacy. That's the difference for sure. Uh, I am Charlie. What's going on, Scott? MK, uh, Big Drew said, if you're getting MK from a website, there's no guarantee. It wasn't prescribed. I love my MK677 from Titan. And I bet you're going to get results from it, too. From ours, for sure, 100%, we can back it. Question, what's the best GH floating around now? So GH floating around, listen, so we don't do anything like, you know, extracurricular. We don't even prescribe growth hormone. It's not a controlled substance, but it is really highly regulated as far as by the DEA. They don't want physicians prescribing it for recovery, uh, for athletes, for anti-aging. So we don't do it. But there are other alternatives that we do do. So IGF-1, LR3 is a great one. I think that's a lot more bang for your buck. You're going to get it, you know, probably around a fraction of the cost or a third of the cost of what you real growth hormone. Because, you know, if somebody asks me, what's the best GH floating around right now? I say, listen, you're going to go get, like, regular growth hormone, right? You know, like the pen or, you know, like from Pfizer or, you know, Omnitrope or whatever it is. Those are real manufactured, like, from Walgreens type type deals. And that's the only thing that we get. You can't compound growth hormone and compound any pharmacy. It's illegal. Uh, Big Pharma put an end to that bad boy a long time ago, years and years ago. So I really wouldn't take any uh, any risk I would say, and buying something like that from the black market or anything like that, guys. And if I did, right, if I did, and I never would, so I'm just telling you, this is like a fake scenario. If I did, I would blood test IGF-1 levels. You know, some people say, listen, oh, yeah, test growth hormone serum. Growth hormone serum is not going to tell you what the result is. 
uh, as far as, because when you get growth hormone and you introduce growth hormone in the body, or even growth hormone itself, right, goes from the pituitary into the liver, liver converts, converts an IGF-1, 2, and 3. And IGF-1 is really what you get all the benefits from. That's what you get all the benefits from. It's not growth hormone, yeah, it's from growth hormone because it converts in the body, but this goes through a process and cycles down, and that's really what you get the benefits from. So if you're getting the benefits straight from that, why not go right to the finish line? Start line, the finish line, and skip the race. So that's a big one, right? CJC with Ipiron. That's another good one. I think that's out there. It's a GHRH. It's a growth hormone releasing hormone peptide. Uh, both of them, they work very well. Um, they're not going to overstimulate the pituitary as well. So this is just some things to think about. Jordan Fitz said, what's the difference between tighten up and tighten complete? Great question. Get it all the time. So the difference between tighten up and tighten complete, they're very, very similar, right? Very similar. The reason was, was Titan Up was one of the, the first ever Titan Medical Center uh, customized blends, and it had a number of different properties. But we wanted to get it a little bit better because we had Titan Up and then we had Titan Strong. And Titan Strong, all Titan Strong was, was the three branch chain amino acids. So I said, listen, and we were selling that for 180 bucks and 180 bucks, that was $360 to get both of those injectables. Then you had to take two different injections to get all the, the different ingredients in it, right? So I was like, listen, we gotta come up with something better. Um, that was, I was like, you know what? If we can do it, it's soluble wise, it was gonna work combination wise, let's put these together, save some money for the patients, and at that point, it's complete. That's Titan Complete. That's how Titan Complete came. So, the difference, the only difference in Titan Up and Titan Complete, is Titan Complete, you're gonna get two more all you're going to get all three branch chain amino acids which in tightened up you're only getting one that's the difference so you know it's a couple more ingredients and these other ingredients are going to be essential for a lot of different things so that's the difference between tighten up and tighten complete all right what's good irishman how you doing brother all right big drew in the comments star star side you know it uh what's the best time therapy for building the muscle thanks so there's a couple different ones. Like I said, IGF one's a good one. CJC with Ipiron is the other good one. MK six seven seven. I've used a Morton. Uh, you don't need no blood work for for the MK or CJC for IGF one. You would need blood work. Um, that's a good one. I mean, make sure that everything else is dialed in too. Um, so make sure hormones are dialed in. That's the first thing in foundation. Once those things are dialed in for building clean, clean, lean body mass or lean muscle, really look at like I said MK. IGF-1, CAC with Ipiron. Those are going to be some really, really good ones you can look at, 100%. All right. Gino, what's going on? How you doing? All right. Good evening. How long do, How long until one starts seeing results? So, Mark, it really depends on what therapy you're taking, right, and what results you're literally looking for. So, if you're looking for weight loss results, depending on what therapies you're taking, you know, this could be, you know, the week one to week three, really. If it's hormone replacement therapy. And it involves testosterone. We usually say give us about two to three weeks to start really getting it going. Your levels just start coming up. You just start feeling better and better and better over time. Okay? So if you let me know what therapy is or what you're really trying to achieve, I can kind of tell you. I can give you a roundabout, uh, roundabout thing. Bro, I use 200 milligrams for, for breakfast. Scott, man, I understand that. But, you know, there's a lot of guys out there that might be overtaking testosterone. And it really is. You're taking if you're, if you're taking 200 milligrams, let's say, and I take 200 milligrams for breakfast, right? And I take that for breakfast every day for five days a week. So you're talking about a thousand milligrams. Now, you know, if you blood test that, it's like stupid, extreme, super physiological levels. And really, honestly, man, it's quality over quantity, and you want the most minimal amount to get the best effect, right? So. You know, when you're taking 200 milligrams, or let's say it's 300 milligrams, because that's the highest you can go here at Titan Medical Center per week, you take 300 milligrams, dude, your levels are going to be, they're going to be great, 100%. They're not going to be like 600, 700, no. You know they're going to be like the top, the top of the range of where they need to be in a healthy life. Because, you know, you don't need to take 1,000 to 2,000 milligrams of testosterone a week. You really don't. I, you know, I know people that take 400 milligrams a week, and I think that's a little too much. I don't think you're. I don't think there's a big difference in change from 300 milligrams to 400 milligrams. Just being honest with you, from maybe 200 to 300, maybe. And then listen, if you're really like bent out of shape, you're taking a, a massive amount of testosterone. I mean, is it really benefiting you, 
right? That, that's the only thing that I ask you. Is it really giving you the, the ultimate gains and results that you thought you were going to get out of it? And could you have got those results with, let's say, two or three hundred million grams if you were taking more? Probably. I'm just being honest with you. I mean, you know, Drew is one of my my examples, right? When Drew came here, it was probably a lot more than what he's getting right now, which is 200 milligrams per week. But Drew's, dude, I'm telling you guys, he doesn't go off the reservation. He's not like getting shit, excuse my language, getting stuff and taking it when he's not supposed to. He's getting exactly what he's prescribed. And he's worried about his health. He wants to make sure he's tip top and long lasting. So that's what it is. So at that point, like, dude, his, his gains are ridiculous. I mean, Drew looks amazing, dude. So you gotta give it to him. And he's got even better over time. It's awesome. Your Bobby Cab Caballero. Your products are amazing. My Titan shirt is fitting amazing. The HRT therapy fixed me up. That's awesome, Bobby. Dude, I am so happy to hear this, dude. Things like this, man, I love to hear, man. I I, I, I fortunately get to hear this you know, a couple times a day. And, you know, some people, they don't get to hear this. I'm telling you, this is really, really awesome stuff. Um, so I'm glad the shirt's fitting good, man. I'm glad the HRT is, is doing you right, man. And that's what it's all about, quality of life. Somebody asked me, like, what's the biggest, uh, I seen it on a video, where one of the athletes did, and they are like, you know, what's the, the biggest uh, advantage of being on HRT? And uh, they said a couple of different things. For me, right, what would be the biggest advantage of somebody getting on HRT? What, what's really going to get affected? And I always tell them, quality of life. That's what you should be going for. And that encompasses everything, dude. Everything. From libido to brain function to the way your body looks, the way the body's functioning, you know, your attitude, everything. Dude, quality of life, improving things on a daily basis. That's what it's all about. All right. Fit Commando in the house. James, what's good? Saul, Texas in the house. Can glutathione cause acne? So glutathione usually would not cause acne. Actually, glutathione... The only way I could see glutathione maybe causing acne is um, detoxing the body. But usually, and you can look this up too as well, glutathione is great for the skin. It's great for the skin. So usually you're not going to have a problem from acne with glutathione. But if you're having a problem with acne, guys, we have awesome acne protocols. So if you're having breakouts and stuff like that, obviously, listen, if you're having a breakout, there could be a number of different variables of why you're having a breakout. But, you know, we want to make sure, too, that if you're having a breakout, it's not having to do with, like, balancing hormones. This could be a main contributor factor of why you're getting acne. So we've got to make sure everything's balanced there. If it's something else, listen, if you touch your face wrong with dirt, you, start, you know, people are prone to acne, you're going to get acne, right? And um, we've got to make sure that we're, we're doing the right thing by that. So, listen, we can help out with acne, too, as well. Mind and muscle connection is like a mental muscular pump. It's not a myth. Great point. It's not a myth. 100% Christian. No no way, no how. It's definitely a real real deal thing. Uh, Big old name, Hunter. I took L-carnitine glutathione from Titan and raised my natural testosterone to 1100. I've never been on TRT. Are you serious? So glutathione, do, it does have studies as far as boosting testosterone levels. Um, there, there are some great things. To get to that level, man, that is a home run. Dude, if you've never touched any testosterone or anything like that, hey man, God bless you. And you know what? We're doing you right. I want I want some I want you to write me some testimonial for this. That's awesome. I can't say it, but if you, you can write me a testimonial, I'll I'll put it up, man. That's awesome. Oh, uh, Rikers Island 30. Hey, just started my semi-glutide therapy. That's awesome. So semi-glutide, our Aries injectable weight loss therapy. This one's a game changer. Um, like you know, Hercules Potion Game Changer, HRG. This is a super game changer for weight loss. Um Semi-glutide, man, has helped a number of our patients. I can't tell you how many because it's that many. I mean, hands and hands and hands and hands full already. Um, and we've only been using it for our patients maybe like maybe six months tops. And, man, the results are just keep coming in. It's just crazy. So, Rikers Island, please keep me updated. And it doesn't take a lot. You're only going to be taking 10 units. I'm actually going to do a video on semi-glutide, another one, tomorrow. Um, I'm going to give an instruction video when you get semi-glutide, you know, what to really look for, how you're going to really inject this, and you know, how much you should be really looking to inject. You know, because some people I've had an issue with, and usually we never do, about how much they're injecting. And some people are injecting a lot, and you don't need a lot of this. That's the thing about semi-glutide. A little semi-glutide goes a long way. Um, so I'm really, really, I'm really happy that you just started that, that therapy, and I really want to know how it is going. So if you would join me week in and week out and just let me know some updates or when you can, I'd love it. Even tell the staff, man, tell them, tell me, I would love to hear this stuff, guys. 
Uh, I agree. I told my friends to get MK from Titan. Made me gain 30 pounds and I feel safe. That's the biggest thing. You're going to be medically monitored as well, right? So, you know, you have a provider looking at your stuff. And, you know, just for MK, so let's talk about that. Is MK677 good for everyone? Now, I would say for majority of people, uh, the, the providers, the medical providers would say yes. Um, and we'll ask them. But majority of the people, they're going to say yes. Now, there are certain things that you're going to want to look for, you know, that it might not be good for. Right? And this is somebody that has maybe their diabetes type 2, because it could possibly raise sugar levels on a little bit. Um, or um, has a family history or health history of, let's say, cancer. So when we talk about MK677, we talk about ibunomortin, that's what it is. And what is it? So a lot of people, when it first came out, they categorized it as SARMs, which they miscategorized it. It's not a SARM. It's actually a GHRH oral peptide. So it's a growth hormone releasing oral hormone peptide. So at that point, it's the only one in its class that does what it does. And with you know stimulating growth hormone levels, raising IGF-1 levels too as well for recovery and all these other benefits, if you have cancer history or you know family history of cancer that put you at really, really high risk, this is something we need to look at. Because we don't want to negatively affect you. And what this is going to do is help grow cells in the body, good cells and bad cells. So, you know, this is something that a medical provider should definitely look at for a medication like this. This is something that shouldn't be sold over the counter or on websites, okay? It could actually hurt somebody if it's not properly prescribed. Brie Mudu, what's going on, girl? I hope all is well with you. Um, yeah, that, that is awesome, right? Carol Bear, that's awesome. Gaining 30 pounds of mass, that's awesome. Uh, Art said, Aries therapy is an injectable semi-glutide weight loss therapy that will help reduce hunger and prevent overeating and regulate glucose levels to help body process sugar more effectively. So it's a great breakdown. Semi-glutide is definitely going to do that as far as curbing hunger, help sugar levels. I mean, and that's going to help in a number of different ways with your health. So, you know, at that point, semi-glutide or Aries injectable weight loss therapy is definitely a go-to and a game changer. Facebook, come up at Ed Franzi. Why do my doctors cringe about the estrogen pills you have prescribed me in the past? I don't know, Ed. They should know better, but they don't. So most doctors, there's no board certification for anti-aging. There's just not one out there. The only people that deal with usually stuff like that is urology and uh, we have endocrinology, right? But those guys aren't really dialed in either, right? They really don't do the best for you if you go there. Trust me, a number of patients have went there because that's where they want to go first and they always come back. Now, I don't know why they're cringing for that. Now, I do know this. Originally, when, um, when, when we were getting Titan together, you know, and I was getting and interviewing doctors that were going to be a part of Titan Medical Center, you know, I always broke down the protocols for them, exactly what was going to go on, medications prescribed, and, and then and, and such. So, uh, anastrozole, that's the one that came up. And this doctor was a general practitioner and didn't know anything about these drugs. He knew about testosterone, but he didn't know anything about anastrozole and clomiphene, ACG at the time, what it was used for, and all that good stuff. So, you know, he, he looks it up and he's like, oh my God, we can't prescribe this. I'm like, why? What are you talking about? And this is, a, this, is a, this is something for people that, that have had cancer before or preventative. I'm like, dude. Look at the, what the medication is for, and this is kind of what we're using it, right? It kind of told me to break down. And at that point, I was like, oh, I, just, I don't know. I've never done anything like this. So an is, uh is an aromatized inhibitor. So, you know, the first one aromatized inhibitor that came out was Novodex, right? And Novodex was a good one, they thought, because majority of the patients they prescribed that to were breast cancer patients. And... The reason is, is because high levels of estrogen, especially in the breast receptors, would cause breast cancer. So at that point, Novodex, what that did was it just it just took out the estrogen and the receptors in the breast tissue. So then it got to a higher level. It got to a nasterzol. And then a letrozol and so on. There's a couple other ones. But a nasterzol is the most common one to use because what happens is, is testosterone is going to be put into the body. And when testosterone is put into the body, then it's going to start breaking off and, and aromatizing these different hormones. And one's going to be estrogen, so estradiol. And estradiol is going to shoot up. And we want to control this, and that's what an estrogen is going to do. It's going to control the estrogen 
and make sure it doesn't go up to the roof and make sure you don't get you don't want man boobs <laughs> you don't want to be crying for sensitive things or maybe your girlfriend said something sensitive and you're sort of crying on her shoulder you don't want that right you don't want more body fat okay and fat deposits in the body this is why you're going to take it i don't know why your doctor was like oh i mean Unless they really know, they really don't know because it is a staple pretty much across the board in hormone replacement therapy, especially if you're going to balance hormones because, you know, you introduce that testosterone, that's going to shoot up, and then after that shoots up and it's a long extended period of time, you're not going to look your best, you're not going to feel your best, and you're going to be complaining to me like, man, I gained all this weight and I don't feel like this and my libido shot. Dude, trust me. So your doctors over there, they just unfortunately just don't know. They don't know this, right? It's like uh, I bring it down to cars. You go to an automotive shop, right? But automotive is one thing. So you have general repairs and stuff like that. Usually if it's an AC thing, you have like strictly AC shops. If it's a transmission thing, that's like a specialty, right? You're going straight to transmission shops. Even those automotive shops, they're subcontracting out to those places and get it back and put it in your car if that's the case. Um, so that's kind of what it is. It's a good example. Um, all right, so let me see what else is going on here. Same for BBC 157, TB500, buy from the pharmacy tight. That's the way to go. What's up with some of these other TRT clinics prescribing or say they have real HGH and DECA and Enervor? Is that legit? Seems sketchy. So I would say it is a little sketchy, but they could be prescribing these things. I'm not going to say that there's not places out there that aren't prescribing these things because they probably are. Are those places good? No. They probably aren't that good um, because listen when I first got into this business ten years ago testosterone was really taboo and injections and all that oh my god but you know the thing about it was was when I opened Titan we want to make sure it wasn't we, we're not a steroid clinic right we're not one of these places you know, it is what it is so you have some of these places out there where it's like menu and like they're flying underneath the radar and they'll just do anything for a buck and they've got some doctors that are underneath their thumb and they'll prescribe this stuff out like like candy. So there are places out there that will do it. I'm not saying they won't, but probably not too good. And some of those places, you got to look at the source too. Some are not coming from pharmacies in what I've seen. They're coming from underground pharmacies that they're staying at are pharmacies, which are not. A lot of those clinics don't even have a licensed medical professional and staff. They're just fronts of many for the BS research sites. True statement, Christian's hitting it right in the head. There's a lot of people playing a lot of games out there. And like I said, I, I, I mean, it's going to happen one time or another. There's going to be a crackdown. Things are going to go down, and uh, you know, a lot of people are going to get, get it for sure, 100%. That's why we try to do the best. We're conservative. We were here for 10 years. We're trying to do a marathon. It's not like a short race. It's not like get get rich fast and get out. No. What do you suggest for a beginner that has low tests but also scared of injections? So, Cookie Rob, um, if you're scared of injections, you can always go with the oral form. There's a sublingual form that we do offer. Um, you know, you can, I wouldn't say the creams and stuff like that, you know, but you know, you can definitely do an oral trochee and you can do it every day. And that only starts you, you know, it's not as good as an injection. Obviously that's the best way in form of transportation. You're going to absorb more like that. But with this, at least you'll get, you'll start feeling a little bit better. The levels will start coming up. Um, another one's in clomiphene and clomiphene might help you out too as well. Just boost the natural levels a little bit while you're on it. It's another oral form. And then, you know, when you can move on to the injections, you can do that. A lot of people are scared of injections, Cookie Rob. You're not the only one out there. Even myself when I first started doing it, right? You know, it's it's a natural thing not to want to puncture yourself with a needle, okay? Um, but once you start feeling the benefits, and then once you do that first injection, you're like, oh, this wasn't that bad. And then you're like, oh, man, I'm feeling really great. When's my next one, right? I'm ready to do this. I'm feeling better and better. So, you know, you got to work your way in. Some people do. But, you know, one of the facts, this is a pretty cool fact, 7 out of 10 of our patients have never done injections in their life. 7 out of 10. And it's starting to move down. It was 8 out of 10. Now it's 7 out of 10, and it'll probably around 6 to 5 because more and more people are doing uh, more injections, whether it's B12 injections or whatever. They're more comfortable with needles and IVs, per se. And so, you know, all that's coming around. They know they're going to wind up in jail, so they wanted to get as much money. That's so true, Christian. It, it's definitely a greed thing, and they're trying to get money like they can. <clears throat> Truck 150, IGF-1 therapy is back for sure, 100%. So you can get that. Car Texas, we got you. Mark, fire out to you. I appreciate it. Javier, what's going on? John, John in the house. <clears throat> How much IGF-1 should we use per day or per week? So this is really up to the user. 
Um, because you know, you want to make sure like whatever you're using, you're getting the best bang for the buck out of it, right? You can take anywhere to 15 micrograms to 60 micrograms per day. Um, you don't even want to do that for like a month or two tops, let your body reset, and then you can go back on it. Uh, but you know, you can do as much as you want per week. I'm not saying take the whole bottle at one time, but you know, 15 micrograms, I would say 15 to, to 60 micrograms, and you're going to be set. 30 micrograms and splitting bilaterally, you're going to be set. So it's really up to the person, the provider, as far as that goes, because um, we have like a tightened dose of it, so you can get a lot more and use a lot more. So it's really up to you as far as that goes. What's best for body shedding? So it, <clears throat> all around overall weight, <clears throat> overall weight loss, semi-glutide, ECA stack plus, AOD 9604, probably my top three, I would say, if you're gonna use those. All right, said, so, yep, those clinics just mess people up, take their money and gone. Yes, IGF-1 is still available. Absolutely. Bob Band, what's going on? Do you do more stuff, what's up? Uh, Puto Pipo, what's going on? What's best to get rid of stubborn body fat? So stubborn body fat was the semi-glutide, or even ECAs, and you can take those together too as well. So you can stack some of these different weight loss therapies together and get a way better result too, but semi-glutide, it's gonna go overall, right? Stubborn body fat, it's going to help anybody pretty much lose weight. It really has, there's not too many people that have it. Um, so what's up? Uh, I'm a truck driver and my workouts are far and few. Could Titan still help me with my testosterone weight? Of course. We help out so many truck drivers out there. And big shout out to you. We appreciate all the truck drivers out there moving around the country and doing what they need to do for us. Um, but it's hard because you're on the road all day, right? I mean, I know a lot of truck drivers, dude. We've got a lot of patients that are truck drivers. We've got some awesome therapies for you, man. And you'll lose weight on the road, dude. And you'll feel a lot better, have more energy for sure. It's, you know, it's, it's testosterone is that stuff that you need. But weight loss, man, got you 110% there. Energy-wise, 110%, cognitive function, better. There's a lot of different things we can do for you. So just call or text 727-389-3220, and we'll definitely take care of you, all right? Ed Moza, Dushan, what's going on? Tampa Mike in the house, what's up? Carol, did you receive the syringe and needle with it? My console will tighten is tomorrow. All right, yes, Carol, got everything. Been a customer, where's my T-shirt? Rikers Island. Text the line, 727-389-3220. Say, John said, I need to get a Titan t-shirt, okay? And we'll send one out to you free of charge. I'll send you a Titan bag too as well. I appreciate all our Titan patients out there, all the support from everybody. You guys tuning in and talking with me, I appreciate that too as well, so thank you. I started today, yes sir. I've been stocking up on my BBC 157 and TV500 for my post surgery therapy. I have a feeling I'll be back faster than the doc says. I can't wait. I can't wait. I really want you to document this whole squad. I really want to see, uh, you know, how fast we can get you back, you know, up and moving and feeling better on that. All right. Mitch Spade in the house. I got to get you in here, Mitch. I know I talked to you on Instagram. Definitely need to get you in here. Um, I go away next week. Maybe we can link up this week or maybe after I get back. All right. Uh, MK also helps with sleep. Yep. That's another big one. All right. So, hey, what's up? I'm a truck driver. I did that one for a few. What else we got here? What's the injection protocol for IGF-1? So um, you usually get that from a provider. Um, injection protocols. I, I don't really think about protocols on here, but, you know, injection protocol for that, usually it's 500 micrograms per bottle. You mix it with 5 mLs of uh, bacterial stack water, so it's a one-to-one -one ratio. That way, whatever you pull on the syringe is going to be your micrograms. So and that's kind of where I'm going to lay, lay it down. And at that point, um, you'll be a patient or you call it and we'll tell you. Aiden Hamilton, what's going on? Kansas Red in the house. What is IGF-1 therapy? All right, so, or what is IGF-1? So IGF-1 is Insulin Growth Factor 1. That's what it stands for. And IGF-1 is what um, growth hormone converts into in the liver. So we have growth hormone, right? Goes down to the liver and then it converts to the liver. And then that is where IGF-1 comes from. IGF-1 and there's IGF-2, IGF-3, I mean, but IGF-1 is the main one you want to focus on because that's what gets all the benefits. So when you talk about all the benefits of growth hormone, just link it back to IGF-1 because IGF-1 is really where you see, you see the rays and that rays pretty much means that the IGF-1 is working in the body as far as that goes and that you're getting all the benefits, recovery, revitalization, rejuvenation, anti-aging, um, you know, repair, you know, recovery, all that good stuff, you know, hair, skin, nails again, right? Libido effect, 
That's all coming from IGF-1. Weight loss. That's another great one for IGF-1. IGF-1 is great for people that want to lean up, or great for building lean mass too as well. Um, so the, it's, it's got a lot of different health benefits as far as that goes. Ricky Goodman, what's going on? Me, Chair, what's going on? How you doing, sir? All right. I can almost guarantee that in the immediate future, the most doctors will recommend TB500, BBC157 for surgeries. I'm already starting to see CAC at 1295 pop up in uh, some of these orthopedic centers. It's crazy. Uh, I want to use steroids. One tip. Okay. If you want to use steroids, I will get them prescribed. My doc thinks I'm part Wolverine. You're going to be doing with that TB500, BBC157 for sure. My, my tip for you is try to fix everything else before you, yep, that's a good one. Get your nutrition down, get your sleep patterns down. Pod Piper, Mike Piper in the house. My dude, I guess I missed you right when you came in here. Dude, if you guys are in the Tampa area, Mike Piper has the best events there is. You guys got to check him out. If you guys haven't been to water, check it out. All right, it's Tyson Nugent. What's going on? Alejandro, what's going on? How you guys doing? Once you get blood work, like you get what you're looking for, great staff and customer service. Awesome, right? Your blood work is definitely key. Always answer your questions right away. That's what we're going to do. We're going to be here for you guys. Why did you guys stop combining HRT therapy and IGF-1? We never did. We never stopped combining HRT and IGF-1 therapy. We've always had it. I know there's a couple of months where IGF-1 went away because the pharmacies or something like that, but they've been bad for quite a while. We never stopped that combination. So Chuck 150, definitely call or text about it. We'll take care of you. All right. You're welcome. You're welcome, Marcus on. Phil Westcott in the house. My dude is looking good. This guy defies uh, aging for sure. You guys should see this guy. This guy's awesome. Uh, I have questions. Ron Mickey Fit, what's going on? Ask your questions or if you want to be private. All right. I would like to know how much a full body blood work panel costs for women. So the woman's full panel is going to be $225. Um, you know, that's going to have some more blood tests than the, the male panel because everybody asks me, like, why is the male panel 150 bucks and the female panel is 225? Well, there's more tests in the female panel, that's why. But it's 225, and that'll cover all the blood testing for all the female panels. All right? All right, guys. Um, let me get into what else we were going to talk about today, because we haven't got to any of these subjects yet. All right, so cover it real quick. And if you guys have any questions, please shoot them out to me. All right, so, okay, there's a protein powder uh, recall. And I just want to bring this up to you guys. I know there's a lot of people out here that work out and stuff like that or trying to work on their fitness and might be taking in protein powder. Well, don't worry because it's not mass protein powder. It's not whey protein powder, thank God, or isolate. It is vegan protein powder. So there's vegan protein powder, and uh, the company is called Nutriva. And basically <clears throat> what happened is Nutriva has, <clears throat> geez, <clears throat> excuse me, guys. Uh, Nutriva has a vegan line, and this vegan line is for people that have milk allergies and such. Well, somebody got into the batches that had milk, some weight isolate. And at this point, it's actually affected some people. Some people have actually got sick off this and had some milk allergies. Um, so they're doing a recall on it. There is only like two different, um, two different SKUs, so it's not a lot, but it has affected a couple people already, and people um, get this specifically because they have the milk allergies and they, they want something that doesn't have milk in it or anybody isolated or anything like that. So, you know, these guys, these people got affected by their health. So if you guys are getting Nutriva or you guys are looking at vegan proteins, make sure it's not recalled and everything is good to go there, right? You guys don't want anything that's going to affect you guys negatively, especially that protein. Guys, you, you, the protein, you, you know, the cheapest protein might not be the best protein. So just because you can buy two tons of protein for 10 bucks and you go into GNC or whatever it is and they have the premium protein or isolated or whatever it is for like $80 for one tub. You're like, man, I can get two tons for this protein, protein, right? It's not true. So at that point, make sure you're looking at your food sources or even your sources just for that. Um, yeah, so IGF-1 therapy, guys definitely look at that too as well. And Nezzy in the house, Sal, what's going on? Tony Beatles, what's going on? Watch band work, what's going on? All right. The next one is scientists develop durable material for flexible artificial muscle. So guys, I thought this was so cool because man, artificial muscle, I mean, think about this. Exoskeletons, all these good things are coming to us and people that might need these things, reconstruction, surgeries and all these different things and be able to have this 
it's going to be a game changer. Like technology, when it's working for us, is is the ultimate best, right? Um, especially in some some things like this, where this could improve, you know, dis disable people's quality of life or somebody that's suffering from something. Um, it can also improve different things for us, you know, as far as that goes. So I thought this was really cool, you know, to d to develop material that's flexible, like like really flexible and artificial muscle. That is a game changer, guys. I mean, I can see some people trying to get surgery and have these artificial muscles and stuff like that in the future. It's going to be crazy. I see guys now. They were talking about. I don't know if you guys know what Liver King is. I've seen this thing about Liver King and it's supposed to be like fake abs and all this stuff, like ab implants. I'm like, wow, really? Like, but I can see this. I know people that have got calf implants and like all these different things out there. So. I can see this in the future where people are utilizing it and getting surgery like this. It's just really crazy. But being able to use it for a good cause for someone that's disabled in that circumstance or situation is so cool and definitely game changer. So I want to bring it up to as well. All right. The weekly poll. Do you take vitamins or amino acids? 60% said yes, I take over-the-counter supplementation vitamin amino acids. 5% says no. Do they really work? 25% said yes, I take type prescribed therapies. And 10% says, no, I don't need them. So I think everybody needs them, especially essential amino acids. And if you don't think you need them, you can even blood test through us, and we can tell you all different amino acids in your body and where you really stand. So if you think that you're taking this good supplement line or you know your diet's on so on point that you're getting everything you possibly need, dude, blood test it. Take the Pepsi Challenge. See what's going on. Know what's going on. Then educate yourself and make a good decision about what you want to do going forward. That's really the way to do it. You know, 60% of people are taking more of the counter. So you guys, you know, it's good you guys are, you know, understand that you need to get maybe some supplementation outside sources, but is that the best way? And it, it might be for some people, but it might not be for other people. You might not be getting a lot of good things out of it or might be getting some other negative or bad things like fillers and such or things you really should have to take. So that's where really injectable comes into play. Plus transportation rate absorbency through an injectable, the insulin needle, it is not, I mean, there's nothing that compares to that. Except for an IV, and you're not going to be able to do that every day. But a little insulin, you know, boom, you're ready to go. So for those people out there, really, you know, definitely take a look at what we got. I think we can help you guys out, and I think it will work a lot, lot better. Lashes by Tina Tran. What's going on? I love that name. What's going on? Uh, I'm in Vico. What's going on? How you doing? Dominic Savarelli. What's up, brother? I hope all is well with you, man. I hope everything is good. You're feeling good, looking good, dude. All right, so that was the weekly poll. Events coming up, 8 4 to 8 6, Tampa Pro. 9-8 to 9-10, St. Pete Art and Fashion Week. Uh, we've got Jason Skelton's Art and Fashion Show 9-17. Uh, after that, we've got 10-22, Hurricane Pro 12-3, Cars and Court Tour 12-15 to 12-18, Las Vegas. And then New Year's is right after that. So off to 2023, hopefully. Things are just flying by as fast as I could possibly think, man. I mean, I don't know, man. This just went by this quick. We're already past halfway through this year, over you, right? So at that point, man, it's going to be crazy. So do what you guys got to do. Get yourselves right. Get yourselves healthy because your health should be your one priority. Without help, you have nothing. Okay? So I got to cut it short. Well, I'm not really cutting it short. I went for an hour for you guys. But they're going to cut me down here on these, these platforms. They only give me an hour to be on here. So I appreciate all you guys. If you guys have any questions, concerns, want to be a patient of Titan, have questions about the therapies, call or text us, 727-389-3220. If you want to take advantage of some of the therapies, you don't need blubber for most of them. Fill out the new patient paperwork online. Go to Titan Medical Center and get that all done. Keep it locked to Instagram, Facebook, YouTube too. We love you guys. If you guys have not been over to our YouTube, go over to YouTube. Type, type in Titan Medical Center. Hit the subscribe button, all notification button. If you think there's good information that I just gave you here, there is a plethora of like eight years of information on there. All about the therapies, how to use the therapies, events. So much cool content. You guys are going to love it. Go over to YouTube, hit the subscribe button, not all notification bell, and be a subscriber there and get all the great content from us. And then learn more about these therapies and what could possibly help you guys feel better, look better, and perform better with Titan Medical Center. I'm John from Titan. I appreciate all you guys. I'll be with you guys every Tuesday at 6 p.m. I've been doing it years, and I won't stop. Love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Big shout out to my man Art and everybody involved. Thank you, Christian. I appreciate that. I appreciate all you guys. Thank you so much. I'll see you next week. Later, guys.